In this video, I'm going to show you how to set up a WooCommerce product bundle in just a few minutes. So now that we've got our Woo Suite WooCommerce product bundle activated, here we are on the global page and currently this will probably mean nothing to you. So let's start in the product page. So I'm going to add a new product and because I've got the default um, products, WooCommerce products imported. I'm going to create a fashion bundle. So fashion, fashion, fashion bundle. And okay, and in the product type, um, we're going to select bundled product. And then here we've got this new tab here called bundled products. So here we can search for the products in which we want to add in this bundle. So if you type it, it will show in the drop down also. like so or you can just quickly select and choose your product bundles so do we want to display the bundle price let's hit um, combined I'm gonna walk through as well what each means uh, so this is only for when you select a custom um, enable add all to cart yes so we want to allow the users to add all products within this bundle to their cart um, hide individual add to cart button uh, yes let's do that hide individual quantity field yes let's do that hide individual prices uh, no we'll leave it as it is and discount you can give a fixed discount of say $20 Let's publish this bundle. Okay, and this is our product bundle. Um, our fashion product bundle. Got the product description, and then we've got the individual product and our add all to cart button, which shows us how much we'll save on this particular bundle. So let's go ahead and add a feature image just to make this product page look a bit nicer. Okay, and now that we've created a product bundle, let's head back to the global settings so we can see what those um, settings actually mean. So here, um, the add all to cart text. So we can see this add all to cart text here. You can create um, a custom button basically, so you can name it what you want. Um, add to bag and then in the cart we can choose whether we want to show the items separately or whether we want to show them together we can also um, show the amount saved on this particular bundle so let's enable this and let's save this change and let's add it to cart just to see how it looks so let's refresh this page we should see the amount that we save here Okay, so we can see fashion bundle, we've saved $20. And in here it says add to bag. So let's add this to our bag as it says. Let's view cart. Okay, so currently this is how our cart looks. So you can see the items within this bundle are showing separately. We can change this behavior by enabling this show item separately. So let's save this change. So currently our price is displayed um, by combining the price, if you remember. We can also display it by range, which will show us um, the cheapest to the highest price within the bundle. Or we can select a custom price here. And then in this case, when we selected custom, then we wanna enter in the amount that we want the user to pay for this particular bundle. So in this case, I've selected $65 for all three products within this bundle. If I update it, and then when we view it on the front end, let's wait for this to update first. Now we can see it's displaying our $65 here for the bundle, and the user still saves $7.
And that's about it for our WooSuite product bundle plugin. If you've got any questions, don't hesitate to contact support and we'll get back to you as soon as possible.